The Divine Life Society follows the teachings of its founder, Swami Sivananda of Rishikesh, India, and believes in developing the divinity within all of the world's people. This is based on the universal triple ideas of truth, non-violence, and purity. The ideals are promoted through their literature and is visible throughout their programs and projects. We have various humanitarian and relief programs uh, in terms of schools, creches, a hospital, old age centre, etc. Our projects total 592 as to date. We were approached by Divine Health Forum to establish the Shivananda King Denizulu Hospital Screening Centre as well as the Shivananda Wentworth Hospital Flu Clinic. There was a Department of Health imperative to create these flu clinics which should be placed outside of the gate uh, to serve patients presenting with symptoms and more especially patients who we think may have COVID-19. The Divine Health Forum is a non-profit organization that specializes in, hum in humanitarian and charitable work. Over the years we have partnered with the Health Ninja uh, to do charitable outreach programs, um, food drives, the building of these clinics and other various projects. We needed something, like I said, away from the main hospital, well ventilated with natural ventilation so that we, it, which reduces the transmission of the infection. Um, where we can, somewhere where we can wash our hands, don and doff, and cater for the patients holistically because a lot of them, some of them we may come for other things and have flu along with it. So having the structure outside the place makes, um, enables us to prevent them from being mixed with others still, uh, while still giving them the holistic care which, we, um, which they've come for in the hospital. Uh, what's happening at the moment is a lot of healthcare workers are being infected uh, due to COVID-19. We have uh, in infrastructure within hospitals which are, are not really equipped to deal with, uh, with COVID-19. And so this, this facility will allow us to triage patients and then send to this facility where they can be, they can be appropriately managed. So the Health Ninja has been working with communicable diseases for a long time now and us together with the Divine Health Forum had responded to the call from the Minister of Health to develop flu clinics as close as possible to the hospital gate to prevent those symptomatic and infected patients from entering into the hospitals and infecting the critical workforce. So because of our work, our extensive work in healthcare, um, we partnered with the Divine Life Society, Divine Health Forum, amongst others, to conceptualize this idea and build flu clinics and screening centers. So having this structure totally away from the main hospital gives us an ideal place to sit, deal with the patients holistically and make sure that they are not mingling with others, thereby transmitting the infection if they are infected. It is important that whatever we do be done with a great degree of precision, efficiency and adhering to timelines. I want to say without any fear of contradiction that in the case of both the King Denizulu Hospital and the one at Wentworth, the degree of efficiency of the Divine Health Forum contributed towards the establishment of the centre very, very speedily because the hour of the need demands and warrants speedy interventions so we feel that this was really well managed and we are grateful for that. Because it was situated in car parks and the tennis courts they obviously had to do everything from scratch as such whereas it was the building itself, the plumbing for taps for the nurses and patients to wash their hands as they enter, uh, different sections in the flu clinics and screening areas for the patient beds, uh, the sanitizing areas, tables for the nurses and the solar panels to actually generate electricity uh, for the flu clinics and screening areas. The Divine Life Society of South Africa during the current COVID-19 pandemic partnered with the Health Ninja and the Divine Health Forum to assist the Department of Health in implementing emergency safety measures. 
Their efforts to selflessly come together during these trying times has resulted in the establishment of much needed testing centers and flu clinics at the King Dini Zulu and Wentworth hospitals in the Durban area. The society is involved in various initiatives for this particular coronavirus pandemic. We've uh, launched 12 major initiatives. Some of these, the more prominent ones, is that of poor feeding, a total of 3,500 grocery hampers. We've supported institutions like SPCA and Pug Rescue, uh, the Dolphin Coast uh, Hospice, Gift of the Givers, Aryan Benevolent Home, uh, UNICEF South Africa. And getting involved for us is not only a social enterprise or degree of involvement, but also a spiritual involvement because it helps in our own development and growth, both emotionally and spiritually.